Hi Scorpio, welcome back to your channel. Welcome back to your channel, honey. It's always a blessing to have you guys back here. If you are here for your first time, Scorpio, and you have not yet subscribed to my channel, what are you waiting for? Go ahead and subscribe now and turn on the post notifications so that way you guys will always know when I upload a brand new reading for you guys, okay? Now, if you're new here, welcome. And if you're returning, welcome back. You know you're a diamond. Continue to shine bright like a diamond. Now, Scorpio, we do pray here on the channel. So I am going to tap into your energy. And we're going to pull in your overall read, okay? So let's pray. Heavenly Father, as I come before you, I ask that you guide myself and my seekers. Heavenly Father, peace and your most powerful angels to take charge over this reading. Using my body as a vessel, giving me the right words and the right messages that you want me to share the ones that needs to know. Heavenly Father, I do give you all the honor and all the praise in Jesus' name. We pray. Amen. All right, so start here. The cards has already been shuffled and blessed, okay? Now, if you guys um, are looking for a personal reading, all you have to do is connect with me using the information that I provided for you down below. Um, now, this reading is a general, also a not a personal. It may or may not <clears throat> resonate with you guys. Please take what does resonate with you and send the rest back to the universe, okay? Cross watchers, please do the absolute same. All right, so I'm going to... I'm going to see what is your challenge right now for this overall energy. What is the challenge here for Scorpio, please? What is the challenge? What is the challenge for Scorpio at this time for the overall energy? What's the challenge for Scorpio? Okay, Scorpio. Okay, so your challenge for, for this uh, overall energy is nature i do feel like for some of you guys you're either trying to retreat okay you're trying to take yourself to a peaceful place for some of you you may be having a lot of things that you're presently dealing with um for some of you may be dealing with a lot of fake energy okay um i'm hearing that you may need to leave the fake energy alone for some of you are dealing with a situation right now where these people feel like they're holding you down or holding you back or you're feeling like you're giving a lot and you're not giving back now it's time that you um separate yourself to nature here move away and leaving this fake energy behind this is what i'm hearing you guys fake energy i'm hearing fake energy because what i'm feeling with this right here is that you they may be trying to block you here. They're trying to, somebody's trying to, to really tamper with your energy here. Now, the ironic thing about your read, Scorpio, when I, I just did a Gemini read, okay? And when I called in and summoned the angel here, the angel that came through was the angel of belief, okay? Now, the angels of belief is the angel that came through earlier for Gemini. And I was like, ooh, ooh, I must have some cross watchers here. Now, whatever is going on, okay, this is what I was hearing when once that once this once this angel came through. I was hearing that you're dealing with a situation here that is really connected to trust or trusting. Trusting, okay? It could be it could go in the reverse. If this is not you that's trying to trust these these fake energy then the fake energy is trying to figure out your your next movement as far as trust is concerned now why am i feeling that there may have been some kind of a soul um contract here okay now the soul contract is is really telling me that there's someone that's connected this fake energy the fake energy is a part of this of the soul contract is what i'm hearing however however when I tapped in even deeper, and based on what I'm seeing here as far as your challenge is concerned, I'm hearing I'm still trying to figure out if I need to be with you. So someone here is really trying to figure out if they want to be with you, or this could be they're trying to figure out if they want to be with someone else, okay? So I do feel like you may be dealing with a third part of the situation here that's calling for you to retreat. All right, let's let's go ahead and see and 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 kind of pull two messages here. Let's see. As a matter of fact, let me see what was on the back of the deck. Okay, this was on the back of the deck. Seek. Okay. So we're seeking answers. 
we're seeking answers we're seeking clarity here um we're moving forward into something bigger brighter better so that way you really figure out how to leave these fake energy behind Angels of belief tell me more let's see what's really happening here with the soul contract Scorpio. All right, what is the message for Scorpio at this time? What is this soul contract that I'm seeing here? Because someone is trying to block the energy here. But some of you, someone doesn't want you to find something out. Why am I feel like this fake people, fake energy is trying not to have you figure out the situation. Someone does not really want you to figure out what's really going on. That is the truth. Angels of Belief. What is this? What's the message here? What's the message for Scorpio at this time? Okay, Scorpio. Hmm. I feel like this fake, this fake energy person that you need to leave alone, they did show up as a six of wands, okay? Um, this person is all about them, okay? It's it's all it's 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 none or nothing, okay? This person is all about themselves, they want to take honor at all times, they want to be seen more than they want to be heard. Okay, um, it's it, when you talk about fake, it's this is honey, it's like fake is what they cook, okay, to fry their chicken. Okay, that's how fake it is, Scorpio. Fake, 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 and more fake. And you know, at this point, this ace of cups, this ace, I'm sorry, this ace of pentacles here with the six of wands. There's nothing coming from this person, or are you moving any further with this person as far as what you may be expecting here? Because whatever it is that you're expecting, this is the Queen of Cups that showed up as well. So whatever it is that you're trying to invest into you or cleaning your energy or manifesting your peace and your power and connect it to nature and believing in your higher source and your higher being and trying to see a situation for what it really truly is, which is leaving these fake energy behind, someone is still trying to figure you out. This person is still trying to figure you out because, see, hmm. This person either, see, the thing is, you find, you figure this person out, and they're not happy. Even though there's a soul contract on this six of wands, you figure out this person is moving sideways. If I need you, I'll be with you. This person is shady as hell. That's a lot of shade going on here. This is why you have to seek. Seek and you'll find the truth. Look at that. Look at that. So we have the six of pentacles here. The star. And finally, that three of swords did show up in the reverse. Okay. So see, there's definitely a person that is connected to the six of wands. These two are connected here. So there's a third party person here that was very unexpected, but you're healing from this. You're trying to move on from this. This is where your nature is in. This is, this is your challenge, okay? So your challenge is you moving forward from this hurt. Getting yourself spiritual connect, spiritually connected to your um, spirit guides here, okay? And they're helping you to cleanse your energy and your space here. You've been, you've been cleansed, okay? Strip off your garments, honey. Take those garments off and start cleansing the energy. That's on period, okay? Because, see, even though you've been trying to balance things out here, and even though you've really been putting in the work and you've been investing a lot of time and energy and effort, and everything that you've invested here. But the thing is, these situations feels like one that hides really well 
um, like it's like wolves in, in sheep's clothing here, okay? Because someone is still fighting, and not only are they still fighting here with this um, Six of Wands and the Six of Pentacles, which you've given this person everything that you got. This person feels like because there's a soul contract here, they could de have you deal with a three of swords, a third party situation. But you're you're blocking that. You're 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 healing from this. The Ace of Swords and the King of Cups. So this person wants to return towards you here because now they see you manifesting your life to the core. You're manifesting your life to the core is what you are. Is what you're doing here. Because their energy, their energy that they're coming towards you with is at a ground level. Zero. You're blocking anything that has to do with drama, yet the devil is here. The devil, the judgment, the two of cups, okay? I'm sorry. The, yeah, the devil, the judgment, the two of cups, and the death in the reverse, okay? You have the two of wands, the two of swords in the reverse. So they know that they made a mistake here. This person know that they made a mistake. Bringing fake energy towards you. This fake energy showed up in the form of the devil here. So something is ending. Something is coming to a hand. Whether they like it or whether you like it, something is coming to an end. Something is ending. Something is over. Something is bye-bye. Okay? Um, the angels is making sure that something is not coming any further or doing any further damage here. Okay, is what I'm seeing. Now, I do feel like you're about to embark on something different, something new here. This is love, okay? Um, this is someone that really wants to invest in you and love you the way that you need to be loved. But you have to put something to an end. There's a lot of um, temptation here. There's a lot of um, toxicity, karmic toxicity. Uh, that someone has to deal with. And now it's time that you make a choice here. Okay. Because something better is coming towards you. So don't have fear. Have you not moved. Making a move here. With the two of swords. There's no communication coming in. And it's not going to happen right now. This two of cups is ready. That's ready. That's movement. That's four of wands. That's ready. This is how they see you. I want to give you the world. It's like they're saying, come over here. Come over here, baby. Let me give you what you truly need. All right? But someone is very afraid here to release what needs to be released here. Someone is afraid because someone feels like they're tied up into a soul contract situation here. But into the saying, see, can you should find... See, can you should find... The four of cups in the reverse, the seven of swords, the tree of wands, the magician, the three of cups, the king of pentacles. Okay. So there's a movement here that is coming in. Something is changing abruptly here. Someone is um, finally realizing their word of what someone might have left them to fend with behind here. A lot of hurt, a lot of pain, a lot of devastation here. Money's going right here. But this person who's the two of cups, very smart, very ambitious, wants to love you. They're all about stability and balance. And this is how they see themselves investing in you. Okay, but their decision that needs to be made here. Whatever is needed to be made is coming in really slowly here. Okay. Um, with this three of cups being here, that's been blocked here. Uh, with this slow movement from what you're attached with, with the six of wands. Okay, it's calling for manifestation here. This is all dishonesty and heartache and manipulation and mind games and ego here if someone likes it they like to play that game here but change is coming you're either either thinking about moving away from all of this to start something new here with this two of cups and the king of pentacles here to manifest this four of wands okay um, but it's calling for manifestation someone is still on the bridge someone is still on the bridge looking over here let me see something. Let's see something. Let's see something, Scorpio. Let me see why you shouldn't be on the bridge, okay? 
There's no need to be on the bridge. Let's see why you shouldn't be on the bridge, okay? All right. All right, so this is your darkest fear. So your darkest fears let me know that this is why you're on the bridge, okay? Now, this is all that that this is this is why you shouldn't be on the bridge. Okay? This is your clarification again. If you stay on the bridge, you'll never get what you really truly need here. Um it's all about coming together, but you have to take the control here. Embrace yourself. Embrace what doesn't serve you, honey, okay? Joyful instability is coming towards you, but your heart chakra is in question. Now I'm hearing blossom with your heart chakra. And healing those heart, that heart, okay, in blossoms. Open up is what they're saying here. Um, dreams and decisions is time. Um, you shouldn't be helpless or feeling hopeless here. But whatever is coming towards you, it, cause opportunity beckons the calling. It's time that you seek the truth, okay. Um, success and growth. It's time that you detach and attach to nature, something different, okay. Okay, so for some of you waiting the result, but the result that you're waiting for is not coming right now because the ego astic energy that you're connected to with this five of wands is tapping into that. They're tapping into it. They're trying to block you from getting the truth. Dedicated to effort is what they're doing here, but you're going to have to seek once again. That was on the back of the deck. It came through again. Change your focus, okay? Change your focus and use your third eye doing that, right? Rest and, and, and reconsider. All right, and observe the situation for what it truly is because the healing begins that show in the reverse. Okay, so that means healing is in delay, but you have to reach out, reach out to your solar plexus chakra here. Okay, because this is where the healing is. For some of you, really either feels isolated or you're in some kind of an isolation. But that is because someone has had a, a soul contract on you. But once you start manifesting your life here and, and putting all the pieces together and protecting your energy, it's always going to be withered and you're going to be seeing things for what it really truly is. All right, so that is your reading, Scorpio. I have hiccups. <laughs> that is your reading, uh, Scorpio. I do hope that this one did resonate with you. Please do not hesitate to... To like to share subscribe um on your way out now if you do need to have a prayer request please let me know that you need one simply by leaving your initials down in the comment section of this video okay now claim divine intervention in your situation because god is able at all times okay pray for me as i'm also praying for you and with that said always remember to seek first and you always find bye guys